grace and peace to you from God our Father and from our Lord Jesus Christ. For today's short meditation, let us meditate on the first letter of Paul to the Thessalonians chapter 5 verse number 18. In everything, give thanks for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for you. Let us look to the Lord in prayer. Holy Spirit, release your anointing upon us as we read your word, as we meditate on your word and speak through your word. Touch our hearts, Holy Spirit. We leave everything for you to direct and provide. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. It is easy for us to thank God in good situation, but it is hard to thank God when we are going through adversity. There are bad days in life even for those who walk with the Lord. And I was going through a very bad time last year. And it was during the month of September. It was during these days my car was hit by a passing car and had a side impact collision. I was wondering why it happened at such a time. When I was already going through a phase, another one takes over. We read about the life of St. Paul's. He had gone through life's difficulties, even though he followed Jesus. And life had not been easy following the will of God. The situation Paul had gone through did not end with one. If Paul had learned to give thanks, it is evident that in the beginning, Paul would have questioned God. But God did not answer every question. Rather, God brought in maturity for Paul to handle situations. Do not ask the question why it happened, but always understand God makes a way. When we were in class 10th, it was for the first time that we were appearing for the board exam and we would have asked questions to our friends who had already passed 10th and they would have been a source of inspiration for us. And we all had gone through that fear the first day when we wrote the first paper. And we know how our heart used to pound when we got the first paper. We all would have prayed, Lord, help us write the paper. And the first paper was English. But after writing the first paper, we all gained the confidence. It was just another paper. A person who has learned to give thanks in every situation is a person who has learned to thank God in hard times, difficult times, and even challenging times. The person had seen more times of adversity than good times. Imagine if you give thanks to God during times of struggle. How will it be when you start experiencing good days in your life. We all know that wine matures with age. And yes, all who are listening, you all will be surprised that one day you will be a source of inspiration to many. And you will realize how well you have learned to handle every situation to eventually say thanks to Jesus. I finally got the car repaired at the Suzuki workshop and I did not have to pay anything because it was covered by the insurance company and the car after the repairs looked as good as it was before. See always remember if you have to go through a situation God makes a way to overcome the situation and that's where you learn to give thanks. God bless you all. Have a great day in Jesus name. Amen.